Hey everybody, how are you doing today? This is Bud Brown, living in Dumaguete City, Philippines. I don't know if you remember, but a few days ago, I was walking to the uh, dealership while waiting for the blue boy to get fixed <laughs> again. And as I walked by, I mentioned that there was a story that I had about the Piaggio. Hello. Hi. Hi. Uh, so anyway, here's that story. Uh, coincidentally, it was a few years ago when we were living in the house <laughs> That's for rent right now that uh, I just put up a video. So by the way, you got several people calling about it and I just uh, I just gave them the landlord's uh, contact information so I don't wanna be a mailman. <laughs> just doing her a favor. See what they're selling now? Piaggio. I got a story about those Piaggios. How come I cannot see anybody? You got you're you're shooting yourself, honey. Oh. Hey everybody, this is Bud Brown here in Dumaguete City. Hey, uh, look who I met this morning. His name is John. Hello. So, uh, the main thing I wanted you to see was what he's driving. Look what he, he's driving, it's right next to the volleyball Let's go check it out. Okay, John. Give me the tour. Give me the tour of it? Yeah. Wow, that thing looks like it's brand new. Well, the caretaker keeps it up. Oh. Each week they wash it. Keep it, uh, keep it moving. It's got a, uh, it's pretty much like the Vespa scooter. All the gears out here. Okay, so it's like a, I'm going to give this guy a little bit so I can. It doesn't have an air conditioner. Ah, <laughs> no air con. Watch the pay. Ha ha. It's got a uh, reverse. Got a reverse. Reverse tote. Uh, flashers, windshield wiper. Now you know what the Molly Mobile does not have that I wish it had? An odometer. And you have an odometer there. Yeah, odometer, I get about 30, uh, 30 kilometers to the quarter of a liter. Okay. Wow. I left my fire extinguisher off. Oh! And we put this in, it makes a lot of difference. Oh, you put that the extra? You added it? Or? Yeah, this insulation up here. Oh, let me see. What it just gets so hot. You know what? Inside. That's so why. got to roll and put it. Did you? It's much cooler in here. You know what? That's something that I've been wanting to do. I've been putting it off. But you can tell the difference. Oh, huge difference. Okay, that settles it. And did you have the lights, the interior light put in, or it was already no, there? No, all of that's standard. Okay. Pretty much what you say is standard, except for the doors and the
self-directed. I like this, and I like the way this can open up and the air can flow through. Yeah, we got a, yeah, it's, it's not really enough pure storage. Yeah. So guys yeah. making us a storage unit of stainless steel. There you go. So I went across with a lock on it. Now where do you put in the gasoline? Or the petrol? Yeah. Oh, right there. It's got a lock on it. I don't think you have to worry too much about that, though. Not really. Now these have... So this is open, no door on that one, right? Yeah. And this one has a door. No, both of these have doors. Oh, really? Yeah. They have doors, and of course they have the rain flaps if you want to put them on. Where the heck is the engine? How do they put the door on? Engines? Yeah, it's got engines. It's already pre drilled for them and all that. So far, we've left it open just for the uh, Sure. I think the that's airport. I would. Yeah. And you've got uh it's, it's nighttime security the only reason we want to put them on. Yeah. What part are you doing? Oh, yeah, I got a spare tire. Right there. All that good stuff. So. Man, I really like the looks of that thing. The, this looks like the baby that wished it was this one. <laughs> you know? Well we just figured we'd go ahead and pay the 150 for this. 150? Yeah. Okay. This is 90. That's that's stripped. Yeah. Not including the modification. But I like I really like the looks of that. Man, that's nice. And uh, you've had it how long now? Uh, we've had it since August. August. So it's September, October, November. Four months. Just enough to get it broke in. We got it off the road one time into the puddles of water. How did that go? Big rocks. Oh, it was fine. Yeah. I was surprised it made it, but it didn't have anything broken. Non-polluting vehicle. Yeah. It comes with gas, diesel, or petrol. Really? Yeah. So, it's really just I love it. I love it. And that is all right. All right. See, Los Angeles.
if I can park here or not, but we'll see. Wouldn't you know that somebody behind me? While I was sitting in the restaurant, one of my favorite restaurants, I was thinking about how I was how I was going to do this video on uh, somebody's coming. How I was going to do this video on uh, the Piaggio, and I was saying to myself. be sure and point out that uh, the Piaggio is made from the uh, mother company Vespa which is a uh, good quality high reputation company in Italy at that point I had a very strange feeling somebody was staring at me 